Naisip ko na ang ganda nung Tawis kasi meron siyang someone. So ito, yung Rasha siya. Meron tayong parang assist na ang sexy-sexy niya. Walang Arba kasi! Since Legend of Mirror yung pinagbasihan ngayon ng Mirror M, nagbalik siya sa three main classes. Kanina, inikot ko tong Bitson. So meron na dito street stall trading district. Pwede kayo actually magtayo ng street stall dito. Tapos pwede na kayo mag-sell. Wow! Ang generous naman nila ngayon sa closed beta. Namigay sila ng 100 thousand dark steel. Gusto ko actually ipakita sa inyo guys yung mga differences between Mirror M and Mirror 4. Medyo magiging convenient siya para sa mga players na naglalaro over on mobile. Pero yung pinaka-difference para sa akin ngayon, magkakaroon na siya ng profession kung wala kang trabaho sa totoong buhay. <laughs> Pwede ka magkatrabaho dito. Kasi guys, magkakaroon siya ng occupation dito. Pwede ka mag-set up ng stalls tapos maglagay ng sarili mong business dito sa game. It's either you guys make your character stronger here sa advancement or make your character stronger through profession. Magkakaroon sila dito ng panibagong system which is mandala kung saan you guys can set aside some orbs. So if you guys are aiming to make your character stronger, dito siya sa combat mandala. And kung yung plan nyo naman dito sa mandala natin guys is to actually earn from the game so profession side naman siya oh my goodness so you guys can actually spin your mandala going towards your preferred path ito lang guys pag na start nyo na yung mandala ninyo wala na siyang atrasan balik tayo sa grind natin okay na pala to si karma si valak si sparks si sutukan wow oh, kayo sutukan kanina pa to may ingig ah <laughs> oh, wait wait pataas lang ako ng power kailangan ko lang tong i-enhance Gogi, sobra swerte ko! Yes, let's go! Hindi ko nababasaga ng items, guys! Easy. Lego! I'm excited to play now. Our dungeon for today's video, mga kaibigan! So, ito guys, tip ko para sa inyo para matapos nyo agad itong ating quest. Bawal may mamatay, guys. Because every time may namamatay, nababawasan yung time ng ating. Si Karma yung easily. So, yung mechanics ng boss na ito, may mga poisonous. Masakit po siya. So, yung raksasya natin yung dapat mag-hit. Pak! Pak! Mamatay yung raksasya ko. Huwag kayo sa suka! Ang kumatigang! Imagine ninyo yung totoong buhay ito. Siyempre, pag may ito ng suka, upin kayo! Oh my goodness gracious! Ang aking machuista na avatar. Basically, yung pinaka-difference niya is that it's a completely different game in terms of graphics, in terms of gameplay. It is both an MMORPG, but this time, it's parang action RPG feel into the game, whereas Mirror 4, para siyang oriental fantasy. This is still the closed beta. Yung official launch ng game would be happening on January. This time around, your characters do not have gender lock, but instead, you guys can equip avatars. So avatars can be obtained by getting ang ating iba't ibang mga avatars naman. So in Mirror M, we actually have Aww. companions, and instead of five, you guys can equip three companions. Some certain pets have auto loot within 13 tiles which actually help you guys to farm more here sa game. So this is the entire difference na nakikita ko so far from Mirror 4 and into Mirror M aside from of course the graphics. So to everyone watching, maraming maraming salamat sa inyong lahat guys and I will see you guys on my next coming live. God bless you all guys.